Jerry, congratulations on the show! Thank you, thank you. Yay, we got picked up. Uh, I, all I know so far is that it's been picked up and I will be off to Chicago in January and that's it. I don't know how many episodes, I don't know, I know nothing. All I know is that I have like two months to still sit at home and play Batman Arkham City, which just came out and I'm obsessed with it. So take us through the process. Um, when a show gets picked up, what has happened up to this point? Uh, you mean leading up to the pickup? Yeah. Okay, so you uh, you shoot the pilot, you're all like really, really excited about it, and then they tell you, okay, we'll, we'll, uh, we're gonna shop it around to uh, focus groups and see what they have to say, if they want us to change anything, add anything. Uh, we're gonna show it to the audience, see what they think. So I believe our show went to New York and it went through four rounds of, uh, of testing. And there was a rumor going around that it was like the highest testing show for MTV thus far. It's a rumor, you know, but I'll, I'll still say it, whatever. Um, then they, uh, the network says, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna give your show a shot and we're gonna put you on the air and see how you do, like sink or swim, sort of. And then uh, they, uh, after, after it gets picked up, you, they still have to figure out all the production stuff, and they there's no scripts yet written, so it's all just like a, a giant waiting game once it gets picked up. But you know that you have work, which is exciting. Yeah, that's the process for for people that aren't familiar with it. It's a lot of waiting. It's like a roller coaster. You're like happy, and then you're like, oh, but I don't work. Oh, but I'm really happy. Oh. Yeah. So set us up. Where's the show gonna pick up from? You have you got me. You got me. I mean. I know what happened at the end of the pilot, and without giving too much away, I'm hoping that my character is going to go through uh, a very life-altering sort of path right now, and I'm excited to see where where it goes. I, your guess is as good as mine. Like, throw something out, and I'd be like, yeah, that sounds good. It sounds great. I don't know. I'm interested to see though, because our writer is very, very, he's just good, he's smart, very, very smart, and so, I don't know. I have, gonna... I'd imagine since it is affiliated with MTV that, you know, they'll be pushing the boundaries a little bit, keeping us on our toes. It, our show really speaks to the MTV generation, because it's about five college kids who graduate college, and and they, uh, they're thinking, yeah, life is going to be great after college. We're gonna, we're not even going to have time to talk to each other because we're going to be so busy being successful. And then a year later, they're still nowhere fast. So it's very, it's going to hit that audience like right where, on their couch, where they are, like just trying to figure out what, but it's going to be cool because they're going to be like, oh, well, at least we're not the only ones who are going through it. Like there's, it's, I'm, I don't know how well it's going to do. I'm, I'm hoping that it does very well. I'm just, I'm excited. I just want to get to work already and freeze my butt off in Chicago. That's what I can't wait for. I can't wait for you to do that either. No, I know. I'm going to like write to you like from the depths of Antarctica. That's what it's going to feel like. It's part of acting, yeah, right? Be, like frozen. At, it, uh, the pen won't even move. You'll just get a dot from me and then I'll have to type online like what that meant. We'll know you're alive though. Yeah, yeah, that's a good sign. That's a great sign. Awesome to see you, Jared. Good luck. Good to see you. Thank you. Take care.